Before CRFC, um, me and my classmates thought that we could never make a difference, but, you know, they proved us wrong. Yeah, we get to do different stuff that I've never done before in other classrooms. I've never worked on something like this before, and it just made me think differently of how uh, young teens can make a change. Coming here and talking about things that affect us and that are current and are going on right now is really kind of a cool feeling. It was pretty fun, you know, working with other people, try, trying to solve a problem that is very serious. I usually don't like to talk a lot, and coming here and seeing other people open up and doing that helped me come out and open up more and say my opinion on the subject. If you hear multiple perceptions of something, you're able to make a final decision versus just what you know, so that way you can have other ideas and other examples to help you decide what's best. a problem and attempting to institute a solution really challenges your thinking. What I've learned about working in a group is that you can't just make up a decision for yourself. You have to agree with other people in the group. I learned that in some places of the world, people do not have as good as conditions as where I live. Helping anyone, whether it's one person in need or a million people is in need, is worth going through hardships for. CRFC me ha ayudado a respetar um, dos, los otros niños que están en mi, um, en mi clase. Never knew that our community was capable of making that type of change. And I think it's something that I think I'm going to leave with saying, oh yeah, I made a big impact on my school. This is what we're doing as children of Chicago to try to make our community better. And it makes you feel like you have a purpose. I feel like you can make a difference. Watch me change the world. It makes you realize, like, wow, the world really isn't about me. It's about everyone. We want students to open up. We want students to talk. We want students to be part of the society. Democracy is not something that will continue on its own. It's something that grows because individuals like you, like me, like these students, allow it to grow, allow it to prosper. If we don't do that, it'll just wither away. Whatever it is, you always have your voice, you know? And that's, nothing, that's something that no one will take from you.